I'm just a dad. I coach Little League. Everything was just out there for the taking. We were starving. For Do the you're... taking? Do you know what you took from me? Well, you're still alive, so not your life. I'm sorry. Whatever it is, whatever happened, you have to hear that I'm sorry. That doesn't mean anything to me. I wish it did. I'm not a bad man. I don't believe in vengeance. But I've got nothing left. So you kidnapped a little girl, and now you want to kill me. Have you ever hurt somebody you care about? On occasion. Not on purpose. If it were on purpose, you'd be a sociopath. I hurt her. So bad. Hurt who, Clem? My son Adam went missing. I took him out hunting even though my wife said he was too young. I figured he had to learn. I came back without him and the look on her face said, You are a monster. Why are you telling me the story here? We all went out looking for him. We never found him. I hurt her so bad. Guess his wife. Then you took all of our things. You robbed us. I could have earned her trust back, Lee, but not after that. Alright. <laughs> you fucked up, not me. You fucked up. The hungrier we got, the more she blamed me. Until she finally took our daughter Elizabeth and left. They didn't get far. I found them a day later in the road do I look like a monster to you a little bit yeah not gonna not gonna disagree there we all do sure I'll I'll humor him we all do some more than others I'm not like you you killed a man with a pitchfork right in front of a little girl I kind of had to it's more complicated than that you abandoned a defenseless, grieving woman. She deserved it. The sweatshirt she's wearing was my boy's. You stole that from us. Yeah, but she was cold. She needed it. I fucked up. Yes, you did. How could you know all this? He's been following us. Stalking us like prey. And that radio. You're a monster. You're a murderer and a thief. And I'm going to hurt you so bad. Okay. It doesn't have to be this way. It doesn't have to be this way. You can't take care of anyone. After I heard Clementine on the radio and realized who you folks were, I came after you purely for revenge. But the more I heard about the things you did... And the danger she was in. Our plan changed. Lee, listen to me. I need you to hear this before what happens next. I can take care of her. We can have a family. No. I bet you don't even know how old she is. She's, she's eight. Yeah, she's, Wrong. you know, like... She's nine. Her birthday was yesterday. Her birthday was six days ago. I was close. Yesterday's close to six days. Be a dad, you know. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. Okay. That's not happening. You're crazy. This guy's insane. Her with you is crazy. All right. <laughs> Let us go. Maybe I'll turn into a walker no. eventually. No, I don't think so. You're going away, and we're starting a new family. I disagree, sir. Hey, honey, I think this is all going to work out. What are you... There's a head in there. I'm glad, too. Uh oh Clem's getting out. I wish it wouldn't have had to get this bad, but... 
It's all over, hon. Get the bottle. Isn't it? Get the bottle. Hit him in the head with the bottle. I hate seeing you like this. I just miss your smile, honey. Smack him in the head. You so much, Tess. What do you want me to do? What do you want me to do here? A lot, though. There's nothing I can pick. But she's sweet. Clem hit him. She wouldn't hurt a fly. Oh, bitch! I like them apples, huh? Oh shit! Oh god! Clem, keep hitting him with the bottle, honey. Clem, hit him with the bottle. You gotta hit him with the bottle. Oh fuck! Get the hell out of here! Now your gun's gone, you crazy son of a bitch, huh? You want some of this? Get him! Fuck you! Get in the closet. Even with one arm, I'm still stronger than your skinny pale ass. Yeah, fuck you! Choke his ass out! Choke his ass out! There you go. Look at that. How do you like that, huh? You were gonna hurt me? Well, I'm gonna hurt you. I guess you don't like that too much, do you? With one arm, I overpowered your stupid ass. Now eat that shit. Oh god, he got out. Fuck. Clementine, I need you to hit him with the bottle again. I only have one hand. No, I'm not. Oh my god, Clementine headshot him. Thank you very much, Clem Clem. You what? You what, Clem? Your arm's gone. Why? That's so scary. I had an accident. We'll talk about it somewhere safe. You don't smell good. Yeah, I know. All right. Did he hurt you? <laughs> no. Not really. I'm sorry, Lee. Clem, it's okay. We need to get you somewhere safe. And then we have to talk, okay? Yeah. Everything's okay now. We need to figure out how to get out of Savannah as fast as we can. Afraid. I was. You didn't act like it. I know. I am now. It's okay. All right. Outstanding. Who the hell was this guy? Why'd you have to be such a jerk just because I robbed you in the woods? I was like Robin Hood. Where's that uh, bowling? Yeah, that bowling bag with his wife's head in it or something. Ah, oh, it's still alive. Jesus. Don't look in there. No, I know. Yeah, that's definitely his dead ass wife. Alright, well. We made it out. Oh my god, who the fuck is this? Is that it? That's his son. He's not gonna bite me because I smell like a zombie. But Clem Clem. Fuck you. Get the hell out of here. Oh, out of bullets now. <laughs> it it didn't bite you. Yeah. I know it. Must have. You're covered in all that gross stuff. I had to get through a bunch of them to get here. That's how we'll get out of Savannah. We're gonna chop his son up and cover ourselves in a bunch of nasty blood. Hopefully it doesn't rain outside like in season one, but uh alright, we gotta we gotta be chopping some broccoli here. Oh no. Don't watch, Clem Clem. Turn around. <laughs> Ugh! Yeah, that's right. Ooh, this nice sweet zombie right here. Alright. Let's just get a bunch of intestines, alright. Dig right around there. Not too shabby. This is your new necklace, Clem Clem. Are you ready to be the prettiest girl in Savannah? I guess not. Well, guess who's going to be the prettiest girl anyway? It's okay. It has to be done, Clem Clem. It has to be done. Now rub some on her butt. Give her the butt buster, Lee. Give her the butt buster. Are you done? 
want to be sure. Put put a piece of intestine on her head. Ah, and just drape it around her face. It's good for the skin. It exfoliates there. it. That should do it. I hope so. And you're missing something. Her hat. I thought it was gone. I thought you were gone. Thank you. Stay right next to me. Walk very slowly. Don't look around. And don't panic. Mm -hmm. I'll keep you safe. Oh, will you? Yeah, let's leave those radios there. We obviously don't need those. Achievement unlocked. What's in the bag? There's that orange. Oh, it is going to rain. I hear thunder. That's going to screw us over, just like in the show. And also, it's really dark up up in the sky from what I can see it's gonna start raining and then it's gonna wash off all the smell look at that though there's some rain clouds right there it's gonna rain it's gonna wash off all the blood and the stank and we're gonna get attacked just like in the first season at least I'm pretty sure that was the first season might have been the second season but you know whatever all right Lee we gotta go we gotta walk a little bit faster than this cuz this uh Right, that guy pushed me, that stupid jerk. What an asshole. Look, there's two orange shirts right here, right next to each other. Look, right there, one, two. Lousy orangies. No orange shirts allowed in this playthrough. That chick has like an orange skirt. Can't see her though, but, you know. Oh no, is that her mom? Is that her mom and dad right there? Oh god, Lee's kinda Lee's turning. Oh no, Lee! What the hell happened to Lee? He's turning. Who the hell drugged me in here? Lee, wake up! Please don't be dead. Please no! Lee. Oh, he looks terrible. I was so scared. I, I, I thought you left me. I, I, I saw my parents. Oh my God, he's turning into a walker. They didn't get to you, right? No. Oh, we got away. They're dead for sure. Get out of here as fast as we can. Well, we can't. There's thousands of them outside. We have to. I'll protect you. We'll push no, through. No, no, that's crazy. I saved you. We're safe here. I locked us in. Get that door open. I can't. Do it. Yeah, at least change it into a walker. Then she's gonna be left by herself. It was only a little open when I found it. I closed it to keep us safe. Pull on three. One, two, three! 